Good morning, Chargers. Today is Monday, September 23rd. I'm Lewis. And I'm Ebony. And welcome to a brand new day of WRSN. Chargers joined Dance Marathon at Suncoast at the Jupiter Harbor site location of BurgerFi on September 25th from 3 to 7 p.m. 20% of the proceeds will go towards our Dance Marathon goal when you show us the Dance Marathon flyer. And remember, it's for the kids. Hope to see you there. Do you want to learn more about Stork Market? How about competing for competition for prize? Do you want to learn more about personal finances and doing your taxes? Are you interested in careers in economics? If you are, then come to the Economics Leader of America. The meetings are every Wednesday and lunch in Mrs. Rashid's room, 3 to 100. Join Cupcakes for a Cause as we discuss upcoming projects or simply to learn what we're all about. Questions? Contact Talia Singer or Dr. Bussey. Now, let's head over to Jello with your sports news. How are you doing, Chargers? I'm Andrew Chinkway back with your sports news. The Suncoast varsity football team lost to Jupiter last Friday, 13-23. The star quarterback for the Suncoast football team, Eric Roman Lance, had two touchdowns, no interceptions, and over 200 passing yards. Wow. Way to go, Eric. Charles Anthony Nicholas and William Wallace Wells were on the receiving end of the varsity football team's quarterback, Eric Roman Lance's perfect spiral passes. In other news, the Suncoast swim team racked up the most points in their meet at Lake Lytle on Friday. At 4 today, the Suncoast swim team has a meet against Jupiter High School. The boys and girls bowling teams are also competing today against Dry Fist at 3.30. This has been Andrew Cinque. Ciao, Chargers. Thanks, Jallo. First Priority has moved to Mondays. Please join us if you want to discuss and all the good word and see what Jesus can do for your life. Psych on Society meets today during lunch in Mr. Spencer's room, 3114. Everyone is welcome. The Thune Elementary School's Library Media Center needs volunteers to work on organizing their book collection. If you're available to volunteer alongside Ms. Armrooster, Tuesday, September 24th, and or Wednesday, September 25th, after school until 4.30, please sign up in the comments or send Ms. Armrooster an email. Volunteers will meet in the comments and walk over to the Thune as a group. Mrs. A will also sign off on any and all volunteer hours. This is an excellent service opportunity. We are fortunate to have an amazing library, so let's share a good fortune and help the children of Bethune. Help grateful is helpful. If you're a charger who loves to read and have a lot of time and love, there's a club for you here. The Charger Book Club meets on the last Friday of each of the month in the Commons Conference Room during lunch. Join us this Friday, September 27th, for our first meeting. Attention all Conferencia members and helpers. Please turn in the money from the sales of coupon books and the car wash tickets ASAP. Attention all Charger with Pride. There is a Charger Pride meeting this Friday during lunch in Mrs. Russell's room 328. We'll be working on the Charger games of the week and home of the week and homecoming. Please come and bring your ideas. Congratulations to Nicholas Capsos for being the only student with a perfect score in the Palm Beach County going into week three of math academic games. Great job, Nick. Now let's head over to Ishan with a video about the National Merit Scholarship. And I can't make sure that you have all submitted. So your deadline is going to lie next week. Students across Suncoast were commended for their academic achievement as they qualified for National Merit on Tuesday, September 17th. There were a total of 18 students who qualified. In order to be recognized as a National Merit finalist, you must obtain a top score on the SAT. Ms. Del Ponte spoke, giving a presentation regarding this prestigious accomplishment. Other counselors and assistant principals were also there. 
This has been Ishan Nareen reporting for WRSN. Now back to you in the studio. Thanks, Ishan. Chargers, are you interested in learning more about dance marathon at Suncoast? Then come to the general meeting on Friday, September 27, during lunch in Mrs. Rawson's room, 3309. Everyone is invited to get involved. Remember, it's always for the kids. Now let's wish our fellow Chargers a very happy birthday. Chargers, SJ will be collecting powder puff paperwork and money for the football players during lunch and the atrium on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday of this week only. We'll be collecting by grades, so find your class stable. Active Vines will be meeting tomorrow during lunch. Please attend to see how you can get involved in our Out of the Darkness Walk for Suicide Prevention on Saturday, September 28th. Officer positions will be announced during the meeting. Bring a friend. Juniors, if you're helping the homecoming float, there's an important meeting today during lunch in Mrs. Davis' room, 3308 at 1220 sharp. Hope to see you there. Hey Chargers, this Friday, September 27th, show your Charger pride by wearing white to support our Suncoast football team as we take on Jensen Beach at home. Stay in your white attire and come out to the football game at 6.30. We want to white out the stance. The school PTSA NMSQT will be October 16th for all 9th and 10th grade students. Juniors, this will be a great opportunity to qualify for the National Merit Scholarship Program, highly regarded by colleges and universities. Should register by paying the $17. Registration fees using the school cash online. The deadline is registered is September 30th. Juniors that pre previously scored in the 90th percentile will have the fees waived. All students must bring an approved calculator, a number to pencil, and a photo ID. For more information, join our Chargers ass Assessment Google Classroom code WIBXMI or contact Mr. Anderson at ernest.anderson at palmyschools.org. Underclassmen picture packages and last chance offers are being distributed in your fifth period class. If you ordered your pictures and did not receive them, please ask your fifth period teacher. Makeup Picture Day is Thursday, October 3rd. This Wednesday, September 25th, is Dad Take Your Child to School Day. Hope to see everyone participate. What do the Hunger Games, The Hate You Give, and Have in Common? Both popular novels were in the Battle of the Books list when they were brand new, before they became hit films. If you would like to read award-winning contemporary literature, consider joining the Battle of the Books this year. There will be an informational meeting in Ms. Borders' room 3206 during lunch on Wednesday, September 25th. If you can't attend, please stop by to pick up the book list. Thanks for watching, Chargers. I'm Ebony. And I'm Lewis. Keep charging, Chargers, on this chargerific charging charger day, Chargers. <laughs>